Ladies and gents, welcome to the Hidden Cup 4 Hero Showdown. In the main event of Hidden Cup 4, which is March 18th through the 21st, the best Age of Empires players in the world play on Hero accounts. We don't know who we're watching. They don't even know who they're playing against because it's random seating. It's pretty crazy, and it's going to be hype. So if you can get there, get there. I'll have the information later on in the video. But uh, the bracket itself was randomized, which I also uploaded, and I figured it'd be great fun to just see which heroes are the strongest, right? They're heroes after all. And we're going to start it all off with Warwolf versus Jacqueline of Hainaut. Fight. So here we go. In the blue, we have Warwolf Trebuchet, which is a trebuchet that does do damage to buildings and units. And it looks like <laughs> Jacqueline, uh, 100 HP, zero attack, zero armor. Poor Jacqueline. Rip. She's out. What a surprise. Up next, we have Admiral Yi Sun Shin against Master of Templar. Both look pretty cool, but there's one chunky boy here, and Admiral's got 600 HP, uh, 75 attack. It's a crazy turtle ship. Master of Templar, I mean, this unit's got some okay stats. 250 HP is not bad, but uh, unfortunately for Master of Templar, you're donezo. Up next is Harald Hadrada against Sanjata. And Sanjata is honestly one of the coolest looking units I've seen. Look at this. Look at this. 14 attack, 290 HP. Harald here is a beast. Uh, but unfortunately, I don't know. The firing speed is really going to have to do something here, right? Like, this is. Let's zoom in. See the micro here. Or lack of micro for Harald. Is it, does he have minimum range? I don't know what's happening here exactly. It feels like. Now, this could be a close battle, and Sanjata is going to get in and get the kill. Ah! Oh, the photo finish. Yeah, uh, must have been a hotkey issue there for Harald. Harald is out. Sanjata moves on to round number two. All right, the next round of 16 matchup, we have Pope Leo against Gonzalo Pizarro. Now, someone told me this is factually incorrect, but according to something I read on the internet, and the internet never lies, Pope Leo once convinced Attila the Hun to turn around and not ransack his people. Gonzalo Pizarro was involved in ransacking of many people. They're both in the game. And Pope Leo was going to have to go for a conversion here. Oh, wait a second. You can't convert heroes. Um. Okay. Sorry, Pope Leo. You're out. All right. In the next set of the round of 16, we have King Bela IV against... I Ivalo, Ivalo. I'll work on that too, YouTube. Trust me, I've been working so hard. I didn't even do the pronunciations for this video. And yes, of course, I could I could just stop recording, go through it all right now, and then re-record this, but I don't have time for that. All right, you're going to make fun of me anyways. Again, unfortunately for the king, we have a situation. Look at this guy here. This is awesome. I, it would be a privilege to die to a unit like this. But yeah, the king cannot attack, can only run. <laughs> Ate one too many cheeseburgers, so can't run as fast as maybe King, sh King should. Uh, what, who am I talking about? That's like Usain Bolt over there. Fine. And uh, unfortunately, Avalio here is kind of playing with his food. And it does kind of look like the King does not stand a chance and is out. Surprise, surprise. All right, the next round is really interesting. We have Cobra Car. We brought in a cheat code this year against Edward Longshanks. And I kind of feel bad for Edward because I think Edward looks really cool. But let's see what happens here. Uh, Cobra Car, probably your favorite cheat code. Certainly one of mine growing up. And listen to him rev his engine. Oh, he's in third gear. He's in third gear. This isn't even fair. The Cobra Car's not even going to take any damage here. <laughs> Who's driving the Cobra Car? I really need to know. Who's driving that thing? Well, it's driving Edward Longshanks crazy, I can tell you that much. But it looks like Cobra Car is probably going to move on. And I, I, it's a shame. I get really cool unit. I like the name, but Edward Longshanks, you are outmatched and outgunned. All right, up next is, uh, I believe it's pronounced Lawa, but I'll work on that, like I said. Uh, a fearless leader uh, from Vietnam, I believe. And we've got John the Fearless here. So, I, I mean, I think both of these units look amazing. Let's see what it what happens here. Lelois just got. I mean, look at those stats: 350 HP, 22 attack, and it doesn't even look like. I mean, I will say that he walks around with confidence. But John the Fearless, 
He fears no man. That's why it's in the name, right? Um, well, I'm surprised this fight's pretty close. John the Fearless is going to go down, though, it seems like. Sorry, John. And this blue player is just like... He's playing with his food half the time here. <laughs> but uh, say goodbye, John the Fearless. And up next is Philip the Good against Little John. And I just I feel like all of us can relate to Little John in some way, shape, or form. You know, pick black hit last in gym class all the time. No one really sees any potential in Little John. But you know what? Little John continues to continues to, to fight and to work hard in life. And you always want to see the Little John succeed. Come on, Little John. Let's go. This is the, the hero that I have winning the whole tournament. Anyone else just loving these graphics? I remember when the DE graphics came out, I was just talking smack on them because it was just so different for me. What it? Of course, Dux is controlling this hero. Philip the Good? What are you doing? Actually, is Philip the Good going to lose because of this? I mean, you would think with 175 HP and 14 attack that Philip the Good would win. But uh, 7 attack and also the bonus damage here for Little John. And Philip the Good? I swear this wasn't Rick. Philip the Good is going to lose. Philip the Good is going to lose this. Little John! Yeah, Little John! Go, Little John! Come on, eat him! Eat him! Oh, yeah, for the little guy. Let's go. That's the end of round number one in the Hidden Cup Showdown. Also, I'm aware that I'm 27 years old and getting way too excited over something like that, so please forgive me. I hope that's not uh, too embarrassing. On to the quarterfinals. Warwolf didn't have much of a challenge. And is up against Two, Admiral Yi Sun Shin. Fight. I can't really see Admiral. Oh, now I can see Admiral. All right, Admiral was blending in with the surroundings. Something tells me Warwolf doesn't stand a chance here. Who will stand a chance against the Admiral? I mean, at least, you know what? The Warwolf's taken out some trees. It's kind of ironic because Warwolf was made of trees. And now Warwolf is taking out even more trees. Way to not care about our environment. But Warwolf is out. Admiral Yi Sun Shin moves on to the semis. Up next, we've got Sanjata against Gonzalo Pizarro. Alright, units are in there somewhere. I think you gotta move them to be seen. Yeah, I see. I see how this scenario works. Shout out to T West for making this bad boy for me. It doesn't seem like Gonzalo's stats are that great. 20 attack is good, and it, there's micro potential there. But I think the lack of HP really matters. So only 75 HP remaining of the 150. Uh, Sinjata is a is a tanky person over here. On a, on a wonderful looking horse. And I, I believe that means Sinjata's going to move on to face uh, Admiral Yi Sun Shin in the semis. And yeah, we see it right there. All right, Gonzalo, you're out of here. All right, up next. What what the, What is this drift? Ah! <laughs> must be a scenario bug. Uh, we have Kovarkar against Ivailo. He's trying to evade, yo. And, uh, oh, he's up. He's on his feet. Run him over, quick. I guess you can't really do that. That's that's unrealistic. Not that I have experience running over people with cars. Why am I talking? I don't know why I say words, but Kovarkar moves on to the semifinal. No surprise. All right, the final quarterfinal. See who will face that Kovarkar. Again, we have Little John, who was the heavy underdog last time. I don't think there's going to be any bonus damage here. <laughs> Look at this. It, little John isn't even isn't even worrying. Little Blue here. And Leloy, Lewa, Lehu is going to win here. Um, Leloy Jenkins gets the win and moves on to the semifinals. All right, big moment here. Sanjata and uh, Admiral Yi Sun Shin have looked strong. Fight. And we've got, well, again, it, it, it just incredible firepower from Admiral. And Sinjata has done so well, but Sinjata just didn't do his research to counter this. You've really got to check out the opposition, you know, get some new build orders down, Sinjata. Sinjata, some tips down, you know, for when the semis happen. Oh, man, the puns are going to be real. Admiral moves on to the finals. Here in the semifinals, we've got Cobra Car against Leloy Lawa. I'm sorry, we're going to call him Leloy Jenkins. I'll get that right, I promise, for the main event. This is a brutal... I mean, a lot of stuff has gone down here. This is a brutal terrain, man. Maybe if you can get the car over the flames, it'll just... It'll explode like in the movies. 
That's probably your best bet if you're red. Overcar's micro is looking pretty good. <laughs> Overcar is allowing... He's ruining the paint job, but he wanted a new paint job anyways. He's allowing those hits, and I think no surprise, everyone's favorite cheat code moves on to the finals. Okay, wait, what's going to happen here? 500 HP versus like 600 HP, 10 attack. Yeah, but it's 10 attack, but there's a bunch of boards. Overcar's going to own. Okay, here it is. I'll show the HP for both of them. Oh, this is actually epic because the micro. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I wasn't expecting this. What? Why is this so exciting right now? I mean, I feel like if Admiral gets some connections here, you're like getting close maybe. I think Admiral should get in a little closer. There you go. Getting close and get some hits. But it, so far, it looks like... <gasps> Yeah, that's the game plan for Admiral. Admiral's got to continue to get in close. Can't get in too close. Cobra Car trying to micro, and Cobra Car's going to use the speed here. This is like Doubt versus Viper in the finals. Doubt with the... He's rather slow, but strong, and Viper's got the speed. <gasps> oh my god! The Admiral wins! Wow. I was not expecting that. I really thought the cheat code would win. Who needs a cheat code? And you have Admiral Yi Sun Shin. Look at how, look at how scary that that man is. Oh my word. That that's impressive. Well, I'll tell you what. That that was unexpected, and according to this bracket, Admiral Yi Sun Shin will win Hidden Cup Four. I of course don't know who is is playing as Admiral Yi Sun Shin, but we'll find out. A uh, fun fact for you. We did not do the Hero Showdown in Hidden Cup 2 or 1, but in Hidden Cup 3 we did, and Saladin made it to the finals and lost in the finals. Uh, and in the main event of Hidden Cup 3, Saladin actually made it to the finals uh, against Katan Khan, which was, again, the repeat of the finals. But the only thing that was different is that Saladin in the scenario lost, and, of course, Saladin won in the finals of Hidden Cup 3. Anyways, this was just for fun. And shout out to T West for making this for me. Uh, really sick scenarios. You can actually see where all the battles took place. Even had spectators in some cases. Uh, I, this was lovely. Uh, please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. More than anything, get hyped for Hidden Cup 4. Uh, I know a lot of you guys are going to wait for those YouTube uploads. Those YouTube uploads will come. But you can ruin your sleep schedule for me. You know, uh, ruin the, whatever social life you have for me and make it to the main event. Um, March 18th through the 21st. I promise you. It will be the best Hidden Cup ever. I don't know what the games are going to hold, but I don't see how it's not going to be great, and we'll have a lot of fun stuff for you. Thanks for watching. Go, Little John. Beat the Admiral in the finals.